As we look back on the last year and the damage done by Hurricane Harvey, some local researchers are taking a look, a closer look at how Harvey affected our ecosystem. Chris Six News anchor Priscilla Torres has more on that. The storm itself actually creates, created quite a bit of havoc. A look back over the last year, Hurricane Harvey damaged homes, businesses, and our ecosystem dramatically. We saw almost a total loss of all the living things in the bay. Researchers say it affected everything from the nutrients and the oxygen found in our water to the clams and the fish. Dr. Paul Montagna, endowed chair for ecosystem studies and modeling at Texas A&M Corpus Christi, says he was quite surprised at his research findings. I think some of the most surprising things we've seen over the years is how resilient the ecosystems are. Dr. Montagna says he and his team of researchers are already seeing our ecosystem bounce back using clams as research. Two months after the storm, the clams were sparse and hard to find. Then in April of this year, small clams began to show up. And in their most recent sample in July, those small clams are showing signs of growth. I think it'll take about two years for a complete recovery to occur. We see recovery happening. Dr. Montagna says although it'll take time to get back to normal, just like the homes and businesses, our ecosystem is growing stronger and stronger a year later. There's a lot more food and uh, we're seeing a lot of a, a lot a lot more fish action, you know, feeding on the bottom and it looks like the system is coming back to normal. Priscilla Torres, Chris 6 News.